Do you know what it's like to be at max heart rate while on this here machine on the Concept2 Roar? Well, today's video, we're going to find out what it looks like for me. Hello YouTubers, that was me on the rowing machine right here trying pretty hard at pushing my heart rate as high as it will go during a test here at Leander Club. So the max heart rate calculation or easy estimate is 220 minus your age. So I'm 26 years old, so 220 minus 26, a bit of quick maths, and it's 194. And during the erg piece here, my heart rate actually topped out at 199. At the end of the erg, at the end of the piece, I tried to push it towards 200, but it unfortunately didn't quite get there. But still, as I get fitter, as I get stronger, it's been pushing higher, and I'm seeing the numbers get better and better. But what is it like to sit at max heart rate? Well, like I just sort of alluded to, been training for quite a while and I've been improving my, my splits, my speeds on the roar as well as getting used to my heart rate being higher for a longer period of time. So for me, I used to be that 170, 180 would feel like sort of 185, 190 now. So as I've got fitter and as I've got stronger, the higher heart rates have become easier to deal with. But even though I'm approaching my maximum, so 199 is the highest I have ever seen my heart rate. It was quite a dark time in my brain. All I was focused on was the last part of the test piece that we were doing here. It was all about holding the speed that I was holding and a little bit of Okay, I'm at 199 heart rate, 199 beats per minute with this heart rate here. Can it hit 200? So I'm trying to pull a bit harder, trying to see if I can hit 200 on the max heart rate, but we didn't quite get there. So my max heart rate will probably be higher or is definitely higher than 199. And to actually hit that very, very max it will involve even more sort of pushing myself to the limit and finding new limits, getting fitter and getting stronger and making my body able to deal with such stresses. But that is the whole deal with fitness and getting stronger and training over time and being consistent is to be able to deal with stresses, to deal with the stresses of training day in, day out, and also be able to handle the stresses day in, day out, without inhibiting any of the training around it. So if you're doing more than one session a day, it's the ability to be able to do more than one session a day without either session inhibiting each other. So that is a great benefit of getting fit and one of the reasons why I was able to not just fall off the machine post 199 heart rate. And like I said, that's the highest I've ever seen and my max heart rate will actually be higher, like I said, so above 200, but it will not be far above that, maybe 205 at very, very max. But through the season, I will be getting fitter and stronger and seeing if I can push my heart rate even higher, even higher than 199 and hit that 200 for nothing else but being able to say I have done that. But I can also use the fact that if my heart rate is getting higher on the longer pieces and on the test pieces, that my body is getting better at dealing with the stresses of that training and of those pieces and of just pushing myself to those limits. But people may think that when you do hit your max heart rate, then you're going to be blacking out and falling off of whatever machine you're on or struggling to do anything after that. But as you saw, after I stopped exercising on this machine, I wasn't falling off, 
I was able to breathe. I was in discomfort. I was in stress, but my body was dealing with it. And like I said, that is because I've been training for a long time and I'm fit enough to deal with that stress. On the other hand, you're, if you hit your max heart rate and you haven't trained for it and it was more of an unexpected thing, then that is when you're going to have some issues breathing, falling off whatever machine you're on or wherever you are. But that is for another video. Hopefully you've enjoyed this little chat about max heart rates. And as always, Yam Squad, remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button and I'll see you in the next video. Dude, bro, 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 bro.